right, guys, Travis and Preston. I'm in Salem, Massachusetts for this Halloween. Enjoying the festivities, as you will see. You're going to have to learn how to pronounce that state a little bit better. You keep switching up a couple of the letters. Massachusetts. Massachusetts. So, so if I ever get corrected on my own channel again, it's going to be a problem. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah, so right now we're across the street from the Hawthorne Hotel. And Kev is saying that it's haunted, right? Yeah, so it's uh, there's a there's a room in there. I think it's on um, I think it's on the seventh floor, so the top floor, um, and and it's just always packed because of that. I think uh, I don't know the exact room number, but I think that it's because uh, that it's it's haunted, and so because of that, it's always packed. So oh, you okay. have to make reservations like way in advance, especially during this time of the year. Time okay. All right, so I'm not going to mess around with it because I don't do haunted hotels. Uh, but yeah, let me know what y'all think. So we're still walking, like I said, to my right, uh, your left maybe, but uh, it's the Hawthorne hotel and literally maybe what a 30 second walk down the street you said this is called the what the salem commons the salem commons is right next to it and then across find like the food trucks and okay like food green trucks area, green spaces to kind of relax okay and then right across from there is the salem witch museum which looks absolutely packed which means i'm not going in but you guys <laughs> tell me if you've been inside and let me know all right. So, I'm standing in front of the, what is it called? The Witch, the Witch Dungeon Museum. Let me see if I can get my head up in this thing. We'll set that right there. All right, yeah, this is very uh, uncomfortable. So I can only imagine what the hell is going on when you have to actually be up in this thing. Ugh. Man, that's crazy. So like I said, this is all part of the experience of uh, Salem. And like I said, and we haven't really even walked that far from the, uh, the Wish Museum down the street. So when you guys come, you definitely park and then just walk around, all right? What is this? Let me see. So the Wish go. Here's still the Salem Gold Building, 1684, used until 1813. Ah. So I guess during the witchcraft persecution of 1692, many of the accused were imprisoned here. One of them, the age girls, Corey, was pressed to death. Oh my God, mm -hmm. that's crazy. Pressed to death on these grounds. Yeah, that's sick. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're still walking around. We just came from the witch's dungeon, buck the right. Now we're almost to the witch house. So a lot of these attractions, uh, you definitely got to get here early or be patient because it's going to be a long line to get that perfect shot. And so if you're a traveler, you already know how that goes. You know, um, Instagram, but have you believe you're the only person in town? Crazy.
So we just got, oh yeah, he fixed it. So I was taking pictures of Kev for this old content. But uh, like I said, this is the witch's house. Uh, looks pretty cool as you can see. Got the pumpkins and stuff like that. It's a lot of people out here. And it's still fairly early in the day, um, just like afternoon. So people are all around. So yeah, like I said, very popular. And then right next to the witch's house is one of the churches. And you said the church is- uh, The first church of Salem. The first church of Salem. All right, so it's like literally right on the other side of this building. So that's where we're about to walk to next. All right, let's go. guys so right next to the church is the ropes mansion i don't know too much about it but i definitely will have a pop-up but if you watch hocus pocus the first one this is one of the uh, early scenes in the movie you might recognize it allison's house allison house At you got ropes it mansion. and ups ropes mansion yep. all right let's keep going guys so we just walked from the hocus pocus hocus pocus <laughs> hocus pocus uh house so right now you see i know you know who that is leave a comment who is that all right if you say anything outside of samantha from bewitch you're wrong all right now i need to know who can wiggle their nose because i know i damn sure all right i know i do uh, damn sure can't so let me know as you can see like i said there's lots of stuff to do down in salem i hope you're enjoying the tour and also make sure you like, subscribe, uh, and leave a comment, all right? That's a nice little plaza. Got Kev back there. The <laughs> Let's keep pushing. Right, guys so we just got to charter street cemetery all right so this is where all the supposed witches were uh, buried as you can see they have tombstones and, and markers um all around and if you follow me you can kind of see like this is margaret scott i can't remember the exact number of people that were actually uh died i think i want to say it's around either 20 or 30 some uh witches in a sense that were died and they're all buried pretty much buried here so as you can see the cemetery, but let's just keep going, all right? And as you can see, a lot of people come here to uh, either pay respect or some, some of these individuals believe they are actual witches. 
and uh which is hey i don't really you know get into that but if you believe you're a witch hey you're a witch then so like i said you got people behind me uh standing in the on doing the graves trying to check out what they can see uh people come from all around uh, the world to come here. So let's just keep walking and you can see more of the tombstones. And like I said, you can visit some of the, some of the witches. All right guys, so this is kind of towards um, the end of the tour which we're going to end it right next to the cemetery. And as you can see, we have different craft shops. Uh, we got the Pentagram, which is a rich craft and uh, magic shop. We have uh, the Paprika Grill, which is a Turkish cuisine. We have the Salem Witch Village, which they have different tickets. Uh, we got a Witchcraft History of Salem, 1692, which have different things that you can do. Um, you have a wax museum to, the, to my right over here. And also, you have a Salem Witch Village where you can get all types of souvenirs, all right? So like I said, the parking is very limited, so get here early, especially during October. And what you want to do is you want to find some, some meter parking and make sure you pay attention to that meter, all right? Because I don't want you guys getting told. Talking about Preston told me to park right here, all right? So uh, like I said, make sure that you like, subscribe, leave a comment, uh, tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend, and make sure that you come back next week like I said, I drop a video every Monday around 2 o'clock p.m., 1400 for you military people. And I'll see you next week. Travels to Preston, out.